Hey guys, what's going on? This is Noob Yamas over here, and we are back at it again with another playthrough this weekend. So today we are going to play some Assassin's Creed 3. So we are. I could start a new series if this video hits minimum 50 to 60 views. Maybe I don't know. I'll I'll, I'll try to start a series. Anyways, guys, uh, this was a recommendation from a uh, fan of ours. So. Anyways, let's let's begin our journey. So of course the name will be Noob. Oh, okay, nice. Game. Oh. Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up, or laughed them off. Sometimes both, but we never took them seriously. Maybe we should have. Yeah, we should. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This hmm. boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call Pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden, some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years, even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do. And the Templars have the upper hand these days. Ooh, something assassins larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching. Bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. To Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon though, soon we'll know. That ominous date fast approaches. December 21st, 2012. Nothing really happened on None that day in your life, bring, though. Only that this is where they want us to be. When it does. They've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization the ones who came before. A precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him, however we can. His name, is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. Whew, so that was some intense intro, though. So, if you don't know the backstory, Desmond Miles is, is a bartender actually, and he had the DNA identical to Altai in Ezio. So, they both were enough uh, master assassins, and they gather different information and through that discover we're uh, here truth I mean he obtained the apple of Eden from from the story of Ezio I guess and uh, yeah now here is uh, he is in the vault that may save our earth so yeah he's our last stand or final stand but 
I don't want to give you guys any spoilers. Of course, you, many of you would actually play it. So. This game actually is gorgeous. I mean, look at this beauty, man. Look at this, man. So, she's Rebecca. This is Sean, and uh, I forgot this uh, fellow's name is Desmond's father. I don't know his name. Forgot, actually. Keep it dude, keep it, keep it, keep it. In another moment, down went Alice after it. Never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. So, the Templars don't know the location of Void, right? I think so, yeah. Um, guys, don't expect anything from me. I'm a, I'm a noob at this game. I mean, I play not too much new me too. Don't worry, I, I play nice. Almost I played every single Assassin's Creed the game there is, except for Assassin's Creed Unity, uh, which is the worst game. You're already there, bro. No, my... Don't worry, I'll miss you. We'll meet afterwards on the other side. Guys? Guys? What are you doing up there, you... Calm down here, let's have some fun. Alright, lazy bastards. I will go. Don't come. Lazy bastards. Oh, come on. See, see, my little friend is coming. Why don't you come, you bastards? I don't know. They let's not come. Single handedly. Save the earth. Don't take credit afterwards that you save the earth. Okay, okay. How did they teleport over here? How how the hell did they teleport? I don't know, lazy bastards after hearing my speech, a small speech, they that come down. Okay. Hmm. Haven't you learned in childhood you should not see you should not touch any strange things which which fell on the ground, which fall on the ground and insert strange stuff. Desmond! It's in my home somewhere, Son. I should find it. Man. Sir. So. When did Sun became zero, yeah? <sighs> Here we go again. Yeah, where to hell, mate? That's why I said Isn't not it? to. Not to touch strange things and insert strange things. Okay. Uh, yeah. 
What happened? The temple triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed and entered into a fugue state. So naturally, Ooh, you dropped me to the Animus instead yes. of, Ooh. I don't know, making sure I was okay? You weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you. And I didn't want to risk severing the connection. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Right. Of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. It's a key. There's no idea where it is, though. I guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. She? Juno, Dad. She's talking to me. Okay, Desmond. While you were, uh, visiting <laughs> Constantinople, Constantinople really? you picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. All right. What do you need me to do? do we all we'll start simple. Walk to the marker over there. Okay, Desmond. Let's practice climbing on these objects. Really? Really, me? I, I have the skills of Ezio. Why do you want me to practice it now? Really? Oh, what should I do? She's Rebecca after all. I'm a friend. I can't do nothing. an obstacle course for real way this isn't even isn't even an obstacle course that's a constraint these are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate okay. all right Desmond follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Templars can I pick up the zone Easy peasy, lemon squishy. So, oh, I know I know what you know. Here we go again. Here we go again. Okay. How the hell did I... Mm, Rebecca, you were really an artist, you know. Picking this stuff in sort of animals. Hmm. Land of a hero. Synchronization levels look good now. We should be able to build the world. Time to find out what the temple wants from you. So, okay. Hello, Hidden Kenway. Let's go, my eyes. I think I'll do only this mission, then I will continue the next episode as is this our first episode. Let us make it a bit long, you know? I know how long. Sir. Everything all right, sir? Yes, yes you shit your mother. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Don't forget your invitation. Ask the birch will be meeting you inside. Thank you. Where shall I retrieve you once you're done? In front of the opera house. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring a round of one. Huh. Don't forget me. Otherwise, I'll be in big trouble. Theatre Royal Convent Garden, seventeen fifty-four. Savage. So what are the um, okay? The first civilization has led Desmond Miles and his allies here in order to prevent a massive solar fire that returns all life on the planet. Now, they just need to figure out how to do it. Desmond's ancestral memories appear to hold the answers. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seats. Okay, okay.
Hmm. You might hear this referral. Just pause it and watch, guys. Watch it, guys. Good evening, sir. This way, please. So uh -huh. Hmm, finally we got a seat. Evening, Haytham. Rachel? Evening, mate. I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? Once. My father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No. His father is Edward Kenway. Spoiler alert. On to business then. Do you see him? Hmm, I see him. He's over there. I see him. Man. These Templars, man. These Templars. The, the stairs are watched. We'll need to find another way up. Not a problem after my training recently I had. Black Maul at set word of trial comes on in the afternoon. Hmm. And she hopes you will order matters so as to bring her off. Let's go, mate. Let's go to climb and kill that fella. Birch, I think his name is. Oh, yeah. So let's. Oh, a thousand pardons. Thousand pardons, mate. Thousand pardons. I told him what would come to if he did not make his hand. This is death without reprieve. I'm just looking at them. Oh, man. So nobody notices me when I climb all the way. Okay, not a problem. I'm I'm not a guy. Hmm, special seats. Where are where is my oh shit sensor? Where are my special seats, mate? Where are my special seats? Come on, come on. Let's go to the top and kill the boss. Let's go to the top and kill the boss. So, yeah, here. Yeah. Uh, we need to kill the birch fella and take the temple key, I guess, and escape from here. That's what he was, he was talking to the fella. Oh, big clock system. Oh, yeah. So, with the mouse left and right. So, uh, by the way, I'm playing on the PC, so as it gives me a better experience. Easy PC lemon squishy. So nobody hears the doorstep. Oh, that's obvious. Beggar's Opera oh, Oops Let's go boys to the other side. Hey mid. Hey dude. Hey dude. Hey dude. Come on dude. Hey Ethel. How do you know without seeing? You should have come to me. We would have found another way. Yes. Then you would have known. For 
what it's worth. I'm sorry. As am I. As am I, so. Really? Look back, hit him. Really, mate. Shh. Why didn't you kill this fella, too, man? He's gonna scream a lot. They're gonna scream now. They're gonna scream in there. Come on, just scream already. Oh. Let's exit fast. Oh, see, I said they're going to scream. Oh my god, they just missed me. That was... Get lost, get lost in my way, dudes, get lost. So... Somebody died in the Oprah house, won't they seize it first? Assholes. Uh, King Charles? It happened we must be the What are those men doing? I'm scared where it's king. Order! We must have order! Oh, I thought I thought we need to have another order. Because the man who killed him is of Templar order. Where are you going? Huh? To hope back. Man. Please. This. The security guards in those trees, man. Mean for everyone. They catch each and every person. We are 22 minutes in recording. Oh my god. What the hell these these many members do you have? And how was the opera? Rather dull, truth be told. Aye. To fleet and bride. By your command. Fascinating. Gentlemen, I hold in my hand a key. And if this book is to be believed, it will open the doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. Ah, Ooh. yes. Those who ruled, reigned, and vanished from the world. Do we know what it is that will be held within? It could contain certain knowledge. Perhaps a weapon, or something as yet unknown, unfathomable in its construction and purpose. It could be any of these things, or none of them. It's none of them. They are still an enigma, these precursors. But of one thing I am certain. Whatever waits behind those doors shall prove a great boon to us all. Or our enemies, should they find it first? They won't. You've seen to that. I assume you know where this storehouse is. Ah, Mr. Harrison. Gentlemen. How fair are your calculations? I believe the site lies somewhere within this region. That's a lot of ground to cover. My apologies. Were that I could be more accurate. That's all right. It suffices for a start. And that is why we've called you here, Master Kenway. We'd like for you to travel to America, locate the storehouse, and take possession of its contents. I'm yours to command, although a job of this magnitude will require more than just myself. Of course. Upon this paper are the names of five men sympathetic to our cause. Each is also uniquely suited to aid you in your endeavor. With them at your side, you will want for nothing. Well, then I'd best be on my way. Oh, I yeah. knew our faith in you was not misplaced. We booked you passage to Boston. Your ship leaves at dawn. Really made that that fast? Go forth, Haytham, and bring honor to us all. Yes, I will, lad. I will, lad. I will. 
so guys i'm gonna end this episode over here i hope you all like this episode stay tuned for next episode